This was one of the first luxury houses on the hillside of Hong Kong Island. This was Hans' mansion in Bruce Lee's movie, Enter the Dragon. This is where crazy rich Asians used to live in 1930s. Geng Yinlei was built in 1930s by a local Chinese couple. The wife was one of the members of Li Seng family. Li Seng was the richest man in the late 19th century of Hong Kong. At that time, the salary of a housekeeper was one Hong Kong dollar a month. The couple spent 600,000 Hong Kong dollars to build the house. That's why the house is just magnificent. When you enter Geng Yinlei, you see a swimming pool. This was something really fancy 80 years ago, especially in Hong Kong. Let's check out the main building and the front garden. This is the front of the house. The house is on the hillside of Hong Kong Island above Wan Chai. A century ago, Hong Kong had a law that only non-Chinese are allowed to live in the peak area, except with the governor's permission. There were less than five exceptions at that time. Geng Yinlei was one of them. Now you know how special the family of Geng Yinlei was. When you enter the house, you see the main hall and furniture with the style of the 70s. They were owned by the second owner of the house since 1978. The mansion has two dining halls, one in Chinese style with a round table and one in western style with a long table. Classy. Passing through the courtyard, the other side is the Rosewood Hall, where the host would treat the guests with some awesome tea and play chess together. If you go up the first floor, it is where the family lived. You may be able to tell that the mansion has some features which look like the Chinese palace. Yes, the first owner hired officials from Qing Dynasty as consultants to design the house, so they could live like a king and queen. So these are supposed to be bedrooms, uh, no more beds or furniture. Nice view though, balcony. Besides the bedrooms, bathroom, and the kitchen, there is an interesting area which is worth to see. This is the pet area. When I'm talking about pet, I'm talking about poultry. The owner raised chicken their own in order to make sure what they ate had the highest quality. Geng Yinlei is a unique and historical site which is worth to check out. However, it is open for around 6 different weekends only per year. Do you think it should be open regularly? Please comment below and visit hongkongguide.com for more details about how to access the place. This is Alpha from Hong Kong Guide. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.